can all grab that. I'll grab this. And they can have their weapons and their... Mm, fortify security. No, that's not her way of opening locks anyway. Can I sleep inside? Probably not, but... Uh... No, I need to find a bed. And the question is, can I do that? Can I sleep in a bed? But if I do that, I'll be in trouble as well. Um... No. I'm gonna have to try and sleep rough, actually. over there, I don't like that, but... Up here I should at least have, like, a bit of an overview of the area. I should be... Okay, let's try and... Uh... was interrupted by this freaking bristleback thing. Okay. It's annoying how those things can follow me even though I'm completely freaking invisible. And it's snowing so badly I can't see crap either. get back up there, but it's kind of steep and I can't see anything at all. Um, this is more the right direction apparently. Down there? Really? Yeah, yeah, I guess I did go sort of uphill. Oh, it's still following me. No, it's not! Thank heavens, I managed to shake it. Brilliant. No! Crap! <sighs> you know, well, considering I can't calm things down as easily as I was able to, I'm seriously considering whether playing at a difficulty level of 72 is kind of... Unnecessary. Oh, welcome uh, to Thirst, friend. You should speak to Skolder Wolfrunner. He's the chieftain of this hall and wishes to meet all new arrivals. was kind of far away though, with a bit of luck, you know, maybe. Yeah, you're being held prisoner, and I came to thirst to preach the word of the cult and to sway the barbarians from the love of drink. That foul Eric poured mead on me, then then he struck me. I awoke in this in his chambers. That was over three weeks ago by my reckoning. Every day he comes in to taunt me and beat me. The only food and drink I've been given is rotting meat and, and, and mead. Please, strange, you must release me so that we may travel together back to the cult shrine. Will you escort me back to the Imperial cult shrine? I thought, Frostmoth. Yes, I will. Come on along. And I'm uh, feeling Eric won't like this very much, so 
Let's ready our calm humanoid spell. Do come along, Marisa. Big Eric is that guy, I think. Yep. Maybe where you're from it's alright to enter someone's chambers and play with their things, but it's not alright around here. The missionary is mine, understand? I knew you were trouble when I first let eyes on you. Now I'm gonna have to teach you some manners. Well, where I'm from is not right to kidnap people. Calm down and... Yeah, calm worked. Worked very well, in fact. So, Marisa, let's get out of here. Are you coming? Are you too busy bothering? Of course you're not coming because you're way too busy. Oh, come on! Yes, I would like to load it. We didn't manage this because Marita is not capable of opening a door. Goodness gracious me. So I have to make sure that the doors are open then. Both the meat hall doors are open then before I try to get her out of there. Otherwise she will not she will be hang around for so long that Eric's gonna come after us and kill us. That's just brilliant, that is. And I'm back here to where I was trying to find a place to sleep, I guess. For once, it worked and with no nasty side effects. That's lucky. I'm ready my calm humanoid spell and go free Marisa again, I think. what I see. Yeah, you're being held prisoner, so let's get out of here, follow me. I guess he basically... Yeah. Kidnapped her and kept her as a kind of slave, although she's prisoner more and more like it's not like she's been doing an awful lot of tough work so are you coming Marisa? good I'll try and oh crap I forgot to open the frigging doors where are they? they are actually open come on Marisa come on come on wow this time I didn't even notice that's lucky so Let's get out. Let's get out. Already my calm creature spell, because there's probably going to be an awful lot of things between us and Fort Frostmoth. Do you want me to wait here? Should we travel together? Um, you just follow me. And now, to get the directions right isn't that easy, but I think this should be more or less directions um hey, wait for me. okay okay I'll wait on the so we're on the ice and fire plains I guess and um, yeah that that's the sauna I think okay so if I walk with the boots on can you keep up then yeah, then you can keep up easy, actually. Um, oops. This is more the direction we need to move in. Into the woods. I don't like that, because all sorts of things can hide behind the trees. Yeah, that's a tusk whistle back. Uh, 
Let's do a circle right or left. Maybe we can try and get around it to the left. Coming, yeah, good. Okay, that's a bit too far east. Let's try and I'm waiting, let's try and keep here because uh we've got a good sort of overview. Oh no, that's not good because we're gonna have to strike south. And there's a reekling over there. and run, Marisa. Can you keep up? Nope. I'll have to wait every now and then. Okay, now we got both. Look at this, a house. Yeah, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Let's try and get out of here. You know, maybe we can seek shelter in this house. What's that? Noshi? Song of Uncle Sweet Chair and Moon Sugar? Something tells me we just found a clue to the mysterious Moon Sugar killings. Okay, that may this way not be such a safe place to try and seek shelter anyway, but. has a magic touch, so it's back to the workshop in the snow, with lovely lanterns all aglow. Hee hee, ha ho, ha ha Right, that's the guy, alright, with the poisoning, slug, scuba pipes, smooth sugar, alchemy stuff. Now, I don't want to kill you, Uncle Sweet Chair, and I worry that Marisa might make that kind of difficult for me, so... Actually, let's try and get out of here, shall we? Maybe we can outrun those animals following us. Ah, oh, crap. Bears. Oh, a wolf. Make this quick. Come on, Marisa, let's get out of here. Oh, crap. 